Welcome to Safety Data Sheets, Toolbox Talk. In order to use chemicals safely, safety data sheets have been developed to accompany the products. You must know how to access and understand the SDS for the products you are using. Safety data sheets, or SDS, provide detailed information about hazardous chemicals. They may also be referred to by the older term material safety data sheets. Click on the buttons below to learn more. You can also access SDS through the internet for products you use at home. The information provided on an SDS may prove useful, particularly if you have young children. You can access the SDS through the internet by adding the name of the product and SDS in the search engine browser. An SDS that complies with the requirements of the WHS regulations contains 16 separate sections. Each section provides specific information relating to the chemical being used, handled, stored, transported or discarded. Let's look at each of these sections using a BOC acetylene SDS accessed from the BOC gas website www.boc-gas.com.au. Use the slide bar to the left to look at each section in detail. A HAS Chem Code is a communication tool used to provide people with the necessary information regarding a chemical if they are required to deal with emergencies, such as spills, leaks, or fire. The HAS Chem Code consists of a number and one or two letters. Scroll over the information icons and click on the buttons below for more information. To protect yourself, others and the environment, you have a responsibility and obligation to follow site procedures and the requirements detailed on chemical safety data sheets. Ask yourself the following questions before proceeding with the work. Am I competent and authorized to use the chemical? Is the chemical approved for site use? Have I read and understood the SDS for the chemical? Does the SDS have contact details including emergency numbers? Is the SDS less than 5 years old? Do I have the correct PPE according to the SDS? Are emergency response resources in place according to the SDS? There will now be a short quiz to test your understanding of this module. Hazardous chemicals include flammable and toxic gases, flammable liquids and corrosive substances. Select true or false. An SDS that complies with health and safety regulations contains 16 sections, each with specific information. Select true or false. Which of the following is not included in an SDS? What information is represented by a Hatcham code? SDS is only relevant to chemicals on a work site. Select true or false. You must get 100% to pass this module. Please retry the assessment.